Today in Hypixel Skyblock, we're gonna put to the test farming and see how much money is it actually going to bring in because... Well, firstly, it's 2024, is it still worth farming? And also, let's not forget, we recently got the pests update. And this will impact our farming fortune. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of pests. Uh, however, I did get myself the infinitive vacuum, so that's something new for farming. Uh, but the gear that I'm gonna go ahead and use is the good old Fermento set. And as you can see, we have the Mossy Reforge on it. For the pet, I'm gonna go ahead and use the Elephant pet. But if you're low farming level, definitely use a Rabbit pet for the extra XP. Because for myself, I mean, my farming level is maxed and uh, definitely ranked pretty high. Additionally, our farming equipment or the rooted lotus uh, items here are also pretty high up there. See that I have almost done 4,000 trades. And the first crop that we'll start out with is gonna be pumpkin and we're gonna use the pumpkin dicer. And if we do slash SP menu, then as we can see, my farming fortune right now is 1,192. Uh, it's definitely not that good, but it's also not the worst. I, I guess uh, let's get this started and let's see how much money we're going to be making. Okay, so we have just finished farming for 30 minutes and let's find out how much money did we actually make from pumpkins alone. And that's going to be 5.1 million. That's actually a really good result considering that if we do it for an hour, that will be 10.2 million an hour. And it could be even higher because as you can see, my farming fortune is a little bit lower and it's because I haven't actually used the vacuum for the pest and I wanted to see how much money we're going to be making with the pest on our island which removes about 5% farming fortune I believe uh, and this also uh, means that uh, yeah about one third of the time uh, we were with the real farming fortune and the rest of it has been low but still very good amount of money now i heard that pumpkin is not the best for money and apparently right now melon is very good for money and i'm pretty sure i should have somewhere over here a melon farm as well so let's quickly put it to the test and uh I haven't farmed melons in a very long time um, and it looks like I need to fix this melon farm because I believe I built this during the time when teleport pads still worked and obviously they no longer exist. But at least we have the farm set up and we do also have the tool for it. And right here is our melon dicer and uh, well if we do slash SP menu or look at this then as we can see our farming fortune is about 1119 and our melon fortune is 57. Okay, but we have a little bit of a problem with the melon. As you can see, while I'm farming it, it doesn't fully regrow. So I think my results are not gonna be as good because my melon farm, for whatever reasons, stops here. And wait a minute. No. Oh my god. I have a bigger melon farm over here. I should have looked further. It's been a while since I've done farming. All right, let's continue. Uh, we farmed only for like two minutes and 40 seconds uh, on that small farm. And I'm like, damn, this is not good. Like, how did I get the gold medals always before? But anyways, here we go. Let's do it for another 30 minutes and see how much money it's going to bring in. Because apparently this is one of the best crops for money. And let's see if it's going to be good with 1,119 farming. Form. And there we go. We have just finished farming melons for 30 minutes and let's see how much money is it gonna be and that's gonna be 4.4 million so i was actually surprised that it's lower but uh also of course our farming fortune could be a lot better so it definitely shows that maybe getting the pest is worth it uh but i just wanted to test it out without touching them just doing the two button clicks and that's all i'm doing for farming but it does seem that in conclusion farming is still worth it in 2024 it does make pretty good money i mean making 10 million an hour 
Uh, it seems that now we gotta find out what's the best crop actually because I only did pumpkin and melons. Uh, so uh, if you want to see that, let me know in the comments down below. I could do a 2024 version to see which crop is the best for money. Anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to smash like and subscribe. We are almost at 100,000 subscribers, which is also insane. And don't forget to use code PARONER in the store if you purchase anything. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one.